Ah, hello learners and uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. Yes, my name is Pierre Senaka. Yes. Uh, mainly in this channel I'll be taking you through business data analytics and examination uh, offered and examined by classmates. And uh, business data analytics is a very friendly paper and uh, very, it's, very, it's a very easy paper. It's a paper you can pass. Okay. It's a go away paper. Okay. Yeah. It's a very good paper and it's very important. It's a very important paper. As in, I took this from a job market experience. It's a very, very important paper. Okay. So today we're gonna be looking on, uh, about uh, on. Uh, let me see. Today, today let's talk about uh, what data cleaning okay right yeah today let's talk about data cleaning and uh, if you are uh, new new to this channel i recommend you subscribe for more content like this and uh, for more inspiring content like this for more educational content like this uh, yeah i'm getting you something you could pay for why don't you subscribe I want for the for the returning subscribers I will come to that form. Let's begin. Okay, as I said that uh, these notes we have them. We have them have them both in physical and both in soft copy and uh, as I said that you, you can get them at affordable prices yeah you can get them at a very affordable prices and I leave my phone number and uh, email address in the comment section uh, you can liaise with me to see how you can get this note okay so let's begin with data cleaning okay data cleaning Data cleaning is the process of fixing or removing incorrect data, corrupt, incorrectly formatted, duplicate, or incomplete data within a data set. You see, when you combine multiple data sources, there are many opportunities that the data may be duplicated, mis mislabeled. If the data is incorrect, you see the outcomes. The outcomes will be unreliable. They will not be correct. So there is no absolute way, and uh, there is no absolute way of saying that these are the exact procedures of data cleaning process, because the processes vary from different data set to data set. But it's crucial to establish a template for your data clean, data cleaning process so as to mount the right way every time. Okay. Yeah. So data cleaning is the process of remo rem that removes data that does not belong in your data sets while transformation. You see we have data cleaning and we have transformation. Let me take you there. You see data data cleaning is the process of removing data that tag. Transformation is the process of converting data from one format or structure into another. So Transformation processes can also be referred to as data wrangling or data munching, data preparation, transforming and matching data from one data form into another format for warehousing or analyzing. This is the difference between clean and transformation. And I want to like in the in the in the in the last examination that is the December 2022 examinations. It was, yes, the question was very simple. Like you say, dancers and the audience, which one of the following is not a data cleaning activity? They say, don't confuse, don't confuse transformation with data cleaning. Thank me for that. Okay, how to clean data? While techniques of Cleaning data vary according to data types, 
see how the basic stitching goes like i said earlier we don't have a specific thing but uh, we start by removing duplicate or uh, relevant observation fixing structural error filtering out unwanted outliers um, someone may ask what is outliers you see like um, we've done our population let's say we were we were doing what we were counting students isn't it height okay so we find that most of the height was 1.4 to 1.67 their feet but uh, outliers now outliers will be able to have some one person uh, sudanese yeah yes a south sudanese it was two point something and uh, we found another short one zero point i don't know if but uh, you see so those are outliers the two point and the zero point and they don't fall within the category of data love handling missing data eg you can be filling out missing data using algorithms and validation and qa question and answer is the data clean what do we need okay characteristics of a quality of data this one is called the vacuum vacuum okay v a w c c u and uh, the first one is the validity the degree to which the data conforms to the defined business rules accuracy true the data must be true uh, completeness is it complete is it complete consistency does it flow from one to another uniformity is it uniform you see those are, you see, those are the, quality, the characteristics of quality data if the data can fulfill all this now the data is quality the data is quality advantages of data cleaning uh, and ensure removal of errors quicker decision making ability to map, map out different data better reporting data cleaning tools Alterx, SSIS, SQL. Last we have the data stage. This one I've forgotten. I won't lie. It's SQL service integration sample service, but uh, uh, it's a data cleaning tool. At, uh, so the problem with this most of these data cleaning tools they are paid for or asked. Yeah, but uh, we have another video done on Altrex, SIS, and Data Stage. But that one is um, a tutorial video. Okay, so you must you must have paid for the software actually to have it. But we have we have done those videos. We have done the videos on Altrex. We have done the videos on SIS, and we have done the videos on uh, Data Stage. How to use them? Okay a tutorial video introduction video that is for beginners uh, we have the videos posted on our channel that's why I consider subscribing to this channel this channel is very good and today because uh, today we have uh, time you know last time we had no time the, today we have a lot of time okay so we'll talk about uh, data management okay data management is the practice of collecting organizing protecting and storing data so that it can be analyzed for business decisions type of data management for data preparation so data preparation this cleaning and transformation data pipelines enable the automated transfer of data from one system to another ETLs, this ETLs are also known as uh, extract transform and load it extracts the data, transforms the data, and loads it on a data warehouse. Data catalog helps manage metadata to create a complete picture of data, providing summary of its changes, location, and quality while making the data easy to find. Data warehouses are places to consolidate various data sources contained with many data types, business store, like how the student data governance defines standard processes and policies to maintain data security and integrity data architecture provides a formal approach for creating and managing data flow data security 
protects data from unauthorized access and corruption data modeling documents the flow of data from an application or organization importance of data management decreases data visibility increases data reliability enhances data security tools for data management we have sql sql uh, or call have cloud computing and uh, let me say this this we have uh, sql oracle and computing we have done videos videos on that but the videos may be private right those videos are paid for because you see sql oracle and computing and uh, we and i like to say that uh, we have not done uh, like uh, like we paid for the software like the organization I work for paid for the software so those ones are paid for okay but the prices are very affordable you can contact me and we shall live uh, you see okay 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 uh, as you see this, this one this one is a uh, Summarize you, you can move with my ma, casa. This is a summarized theory. This, uh, today, today I took you through uh, the summarized theory. As, as even you can see, you see the Chris DM. I, I, I took you through them. You see, this one, this, this one is the now the one night, one night revision. It, it covers everything, it covers everything. Covers, covers a lot of things, covers a lot of things, covers a lot of things, covers a lot of things. You see, even it covers racial analysis. This one, read this racial analysis, this up the practical part. You see, so you can uh, you can liaise with me and uh, you get this. Alright. Uh, you can liaise with me. This, this one is a summarized version, it's incomplete. It's, it's underway but uh, the full notes are there the full notes are there the full notes are there i can show you the full notes are there the full notes are there the full notes are there sorry for that sorry for that the full notes are there the full notes are there yeah 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 yeah, yeah. You see, uh, yeah, yeah, the the full syllabus, actually, actually, the full syllabus. Uh, but I I like to take you through. You see, we have we have everything, we have everything, we have everything, we have everything, even the advanced formulas. This one is complete. Okay, we have the introduction to data analytics. We have it. We have it. Right, right. We have big data analytics. We have right, right, okay. We have tools for data analysis, right, okay. Now this one are the full notes. Also the full notes. We you also have the the practical part. You see, like we have the preparing financial statement, analysis of financial statement, forecasting. You see, we have it. We have them. 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 Even the financial management, we have them, have them, right? So last with me, last with me, last with me, last with me. Even the audit, for audit we have them, we have them. Co applications in auditing, we have them. We have three way order matching, we have analysis, we have audit sampling, fraud detection. We have model review, we have test of controls, right? Right? Even for taxation, even for taxation we have them, we have them. But you see now, for taxation. We don't have uh, the public financial part because you see under under um, under the reporting under reporting here under reporting here under preparations wait 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 here under under preparing financial statements here we have done the part where for public sector you see so we didn't we didn't want we didn't want to repeat we didn't want to repeat we didn't want to repeat and uh, from next week uh, we shall start posting uh, we shall start going through uh, 
the practical part of uh, business data analytics uh, we shall do the we shall start with the december 2022 examinations okay and uh, we shall do the also the pilot paper and uh, we shall be providing a uh, excel file but uh, i think this one will be private uh, for the videos the videos actually the videos actually you, you can contact me on my email and uh, i will see uh, i will unlock if i get your email and uh, because you have a lot of videos private the problem is that uh, when uh, we put all videos uh, in, in public uh, we can't get the the revenue enough like uh, let me say it's not that uh, it's not that way but uh, you see when, when once the content is on public view you see anyone can just come and it will be there for years so like the more for for a private when you come for private for a private for private videos we have a lot of content we have a lot but i can assure you from the our private videos you must pass you must pass all right all right so today we shall stop from there see you in the next video